would say, but I, I just do want to add that um, Bridges Outreach, it's funny, these Bridges Runs are, are really just a first step. When I'm, I'm very uh, pleased to uh, introduce Richard Uniak, who's a, a Bridges Outreach's director, who came out to support me tonight. Um, I remember him telling me, in 20 years, if we're still going on Bridges Runs, we failed. And I'm like, what? What do you mean? I've been doing this 15 years. It's what I do. And and when I listened to him, like I, I knew that you have to go longer. You have to go deeper. It's a first step. I mean, the the, the journey of the thousand miles is a first step, but it's a it's a first step. Um, Bridges is going deeper by uh, initiating, inaugurating uh, Project Connect. They've actually gotten a, a nice chunk of vouchers, housing vouchers, from uh, the city of Newark, and they're putting them to use. And they're mentoring and doing casework and making long-term commitments to some of our friends. And in, with that as an inspiration, I think that's how I ended up doing CASA. You know, talking about going long, I've been on my first case now for two years, uh, a uh, multiply disabled, nonverbal autistic child who is now in her second year of, of you know, foster care, so not, not with permanency. Um, we're going towards that. She is changing where she's living next month and with her maternal grandmother. And my goal will now be to make sure she gets the in-home services she needs and to continue um, you know, being Mama Lion in the schools until Grandma knows how to do it. Um, so yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm dedicated to going, going long and going deep. But oh my word, how delightful, sorry, to be on that first step with so many of our young people from kindergarten through high school. Oh my gosh, the joy it brings. Why everyone doesn't do this, I don't know. I mean, my beautiful Kevin, our one child, when he brings hot cocoa to a homeless man, you think he was seating him at Le Cirque. Good evening, sir, may I bring you a cup of hot cocoa? Um, another young man who's actually kind of a pain in the neck, you know, and it was my joy to send the notification of these good works to the principal, especially when they weren't so well regarded at the school. Uh, he came to me one day saying, Mrs. Malatesta, that man just said, God bless me, God bless you. I think he meant it. I, my own son, Paul, talking all night with uh, a Marine veteran with PTSD, a uh, homeless veteran. Um, my friend Susan's daughter, Laura, I remember one night I was a little scared because this guy came up and started dropping F-bombs and doing all this stuff. But, uh, Paul and Laura were there, and having done so many Bridges runs, they just stood and they just listened and found out that he was so upset because he couldn't afford the airfare to go to his mom's funeral. With all these first steps, imagine the journeys. I think, I think I've been on thousands of first steps now, certainly hundreds, maybe thousands. What a blessing, so thank you.